What's going on, family? It's your man, CJ. Man. It has been a long seven days. I'm sorry we've been gone for so long, but it has been one of, it's been a long seven days. Um, but we back, you know, I'm back. My beautiful wife, Sharice, is at work. So I am here today to record this video. Before we get started, please, please, please make sure you like, comment, share, subscribe. Hit the subscribe button, turn it gray. Hit the little bell to be notified whenever we post a video. All right. So I missed y'all. I hope y'all missed, missed me, missed my wife, missed us. This is CJ and Sharice. <clears throat> this is morning breakfast. This is a challenge. And it is by my big bro, Big Belly Bob. This is the Big Belly Breakfast Challenge. And, uh, you know, I'm about to dive right into this because I'm hungry. I know my food probably didn't got cold. But, you know, it's all good. It's still going to get eaten. So, pretty much what it is, y'all, if y'all haven't heard of the challenge, this is Big Belly Bob's Big Belly Breakfast Challenge. And pretty much you got to have, um, I believe he said, at least three or four uh, different, I guess you could say entrees, maybe? I don't know. But three, uh, three or four different foods on your plate. So, as y'all can see, I have... Uh, this is a grown man plate, but I have crispy bacon. I have <clears throat> French toast, homemade French toast, uh, cheesy eggs, and I have Johnsonville uh, hot links with uh, uh, fried green peppers, onions, red peppers, and all of that stuff. So, And today I will be drinking Simply Lemonade. I have some butter flavored syrup here so yeah that's it y'all so we got to pray and uh get into it oh also while i eat today i'll be playing uh 20 questions i'm just gonna read off some questions while i eat and you know let y'all get to know me a little more y'all good with that all right okay so let's pray bow your heads bow your head please thank you very much Father God, we come to you today on this beautiful, beautiful Tuesday morning. I pray that you allow my wife and my daughter to have wonderful days at school and work alike. And I also pray that you make this food nourishing as it goes into my body. In Jesus' name I pray, amen. All right, y'all, so let's get to it. I'm going to go ahead and pour my, pour my lemonade. I think you got to shake it up. I don't know. Y'all like Simply Lemonade? I usually I usually don't drink Simply Lemonade. I like Minute Maid Lemonade. But, uh, you know, it is what it is. Oh, shh. Bruh. I was going to try to do a ASMR. But there's no point because this doesn't fizzle. And I just spilled it on the table. It's all good. It's my table. <laughs> you know. All right, so how y'all been? Hope everybody's been good. We've been great. Um, it's starting to get cold, like really cold, like stupid cold. You know, like, yeah, like the cuticles on your fingers cold. Like your cuticles on your fingers burning cold. What? Bro, what are you talking about, man? Yo, I love me some eggs, some cheesy eggs. Y'all see that? I gotta get. I was telling Sharice, I need to get a light ring, like a real light ring. I have a light ring, but it's a little one, and it really doesn't do much. But I need to get a real light ring so that when I put the stuff up to the lens, it's a you know, it, it looks kind of dark. It looks dark, period, but 
But like I said, I'm going to be playing 20 questions. Just going to read them off my phone. And yeah. Found it on Google. Shout out to Google, man. Love Google. All right, y'all. So I'm going to set this up right here. And as I go, I'll just put the can't put the questions up on the screen. And uh, yeah. All right. So first question is, what is your favorite TV show? Well, you know what? Let me move this. I tried to put these on here to kind of raise the food up, but it's not really. It's no point really. I'm just going. Yeah. Yeah, that's good. Um, my favorite TV show of all time. It's hard to pick just one, but if I had to pick one, I would say Martin. But it's a it's a close tie between Martin and The Fresh Prince of Bel Air. I think they both were amazing shows. Martin and, and Will in his in their primes, like acting a fool. Mm. Y'all, this is so good. But yeah, Martin and Fresh Prince will be my. I would say that's a tie. I would have to say a tie. So I can't pick one. All right. What? Is your favorite song of all time? Like, how 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 you pick one song? My favorite song of all time. I don't know. That's kind of tough. I mean, does anybody really have one favorite song that they had? You know, one favorite song. I don't know. That's a tough one. I had to come back to that because uh, music is my life. So, all right, what is your favorite food? My favorite food would have to be steak. I love steak, preferably New York strip. Damn, I made a lot of bacon. But yeah, New, uh, New York strip steak. I would have to say either that or a porterhouse steak. I love porterhouse steak too. And normally I can eat a whole porterhouse in one sitting if I'm really hungry. Okay. What is your favorite? What is your favorite candy? My favorite candy, I, well, honestly, that's pretty good. Honestly, I don't really have a, I don't eat candy like that anymore, sweets or, or none of that stuff. I don't eat none of that stuff like that, like that. I, I eat it once in a while. But I would say my favorite candy is any sour candy. I love sour candy. I sour worms, sour patch kids, sour skittles, stuff like that. Yeah, I would have to say that sour candy would be my favorite candy. Um, what is your favorite sport? Football, off top. I love all sports. Not all sports. Excuse me. I love sports, period, but I don't, I can't watch, like, hockey, I can't watch hockey, NASCAR, no, I can't, um, like, horseback riding and all that stuff, sports that I like to watch, football, which is my favorite, that answers the question, basketball, baseball, I can watch golf, I like watch tennis, um, 
some X Games stuff. Wrestling back in the day, I don't watch it now, but I used to watch wrestling. I was a big wrestling head. Um, like with Stone Cold and The Rock was on top. That was my favorite times. But um, yeah, my favorite sport is football. Um, of course, the Baltimore Ravens is my team. Um, indoors or outdoors? Um, me personally, outdoors. You know, I like outdoors. I like, I've been camping and I work outside. So, um, I would say outdoors. I know my wife would say, my wife would say indoors because she don't like bugs and none of that stuff like that. So I'm sure she would say indoors. But yeah, outdoors for me. If you are a Disney character, who would you be? <laughs> if I was a Disney character... Mm, that's a tough one. There's a lot of Disney characters. I'd probably be Beast from Beauty and the Beast. <laughs> no. Get out of here, man. Shit, I'm saying. No, I don't think so either. Um, uh, I don't know, man. I don't know. <laughs> I can't even really think of no Disney characters off the top of my head. Was Toy Story part of Disney? No, that was Pixar, what? Right? Yeah, that was Pixar. I don't know. I don't know about that one, y'all. Hmm. What is your favorite... Who is your favorite singer, male and female? So who is my favorite male singer and who is my favorite female singer? <laughs> my favorite female singer right now? My, I wouldn't even say right now. My favorite female singer of all time is Toni Braxton. I love Toni Braxton. I always have. My mother, rest in peace, is the one that introduced me to Toni way back in the day. She used to wake up Saturday morning blasting Toni's first album. But yeah, Tony Braxton definitely is my favorite female singer of all time. My favorite male singer of all time? Even though I, I definitely don't condone what happened. I'm not even going to get deep into it. He is serving his time and, and to, for what he did. But putting all that aside, his music... You can't doubt his genius or this music. R. Kelly is my favorite male singer of all time. I know a lot of people out there don't rock with cows no more. But what you can't do is take away from his music his musical legend. And he is a musical legend. So yes, Tony Braxton and R. Kelly. Male and female. Favorite singers. Um, my dream car, my actual dream car my, is actually a truck, and it is a, a Suburban, a Suburban truck, Chevy Suburban, that's my dream truck, I drive trucks for a living, and now I've gotten to the point to where I want to actually drive a truck, personally. Too. It's just something like something about driving those big vehicles sitting up high. I don't know, but yeah, Chevy a Chevy Suburban would be my favorite truck. What about dream truck? 
How many times have you moved? <laughs> Man. Hmm. Well, as a child, we moved a lot. Like a lot. Look at my eyes. A lot. You know, and then as I got older, once I left home, I left home and I went to Job Corps. I guess you can consider that a move. Then, I moved again. So I moved, then I moved again, then I moved again, then I moved again, then I moved again, then I moved. Man, about, I would say it's probably. Bruh. Sorry, y'all. It's the house phone. I would say it was probably about close to 20 times. What? What the fuck? In my lifetime. Maybe even more. A little over 20. I don't know. But yes, we moved a lot. And, you know. You know, when you're a child, you got to do what you got to do. Your parents move. You got to move. So it is what it is. But yeah. I would say between 20 and 25 times, probably. And that's as a child and including my adult, adulthood, too. Um, what is your favorite vegetable? Greens. Any kind of greens. Turnip greens, mustard greens, collard greens. I love greens. I like string beans, too, but I love greens. I just realized that I made too much food and I should have listened to Big Belly Bob because he said you don't have to make a lot, but I made a lot of food and I'm in 17 minutes, 18 minutes. So what I will say is I wanted to just support my man, Big Belly Bob. And just bring a big breakfast in front of y'all. But I'm probably not going to finish this. Because it's too much time. <laughs> I mainly just wanted to get back on camera. And um, say hi to y'all. And... The videos that I've posted over the last couple of weeks are doing pretty well. And um, especially the Get Lit With Mo Big Bowl BLT. Um, that one is almost at 400 views. Um, we're nearing 350 subscribers. We just hit 300. So, it's up. You know what I'm saying? It's up from here. And I can't appreciate, I can't tell y'all how much I appreciate y'all. You know, it's, it's, it's very, uh, it's very, uh, dope. It's, it's dope. As you put out your material and see that people actually like the material, it's, it's, it's amazing. And, uh, I wouldn't change it. Here lately, my wife has been pushing me. Um, she's been coming up with some great ideas for the channel. Can't wait to, for y'all to see it. But we got two of them that we're going to be dropping soon. Looking forward to that. So y'all just keep an eye out for us, man. And keep rocking with us. Make sure you like, comment, share, subscribe as, as usual. Hit that subscribe button, turn it gray. Hit the little bell to be notified whenever we drop a video. And... If you haven't already, tell somebody you love them. Give somebody a hug. Kiss them on the cheek with a mask on. <laughs> yeah, uh huh. But yeah, seriously, man. We love y'all so much. Cherise says hi from work. She's actually texting me right now. I'm about to get out of here.
Shout out to my man Big Belly Bob for an amazing idea. This was a big belly, make a big belly plate, but I think it was too big for my belly. I'm about to do some uh, housework. Don't tell Sharice I said that. She want me to sit down today, but I, I kind of messed my toe up yesterday, so she wanted me to stay off of it as much as possible. But I can't keep still. Y'all see I'm down here recording. But anyway, God bless y'all. We love y'all. Come on back and see us. Peace.